Conan's fame had preceded him. His reckless ferocity impressed the lords of Kishan. All Conan secretly desired was employment to give him legitimate excuse for remaining in Kishan long enough to locate the hiding place of the Teeth of Gwalu. Then there came an interruption. Tutmekri came to Kishan at the head of an embassy from Zimbabwe. He and the Sumerian knew each other of old and without love. The Sumerian made no attempt to match wits and intrigue with Tutmekri. There was but one thing for Conan to do. Find the jewels and flee with them. Conan the Destroyer in Jewels of Gwala by Robert E. Howard, an audiobooky production. Now streaming 